Hey guys, so I'm actually going to do a tag video today because I have tons of other things to do but I'm the queen of procrastination so this is the obvious first choice. So today I'm going to do the reader's tag that was created by Books, Music and Kenzie and I just watched Messy Talks do this tag and I thought it sounded really fun and I'm going to do it as well. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Okay, so the first question is would you rather only know the beginning of a serious book or only the end? Um, for me it would be the beginning, um, just because I really like to see how things develop. I oftentimes like um, the first the first installment in the series better than all the rest. And um, especially also with love stories, I love, love to, to watch love stories develop. Like, if they're not insta-love, obviously. Um, I love how they sort of get closer to each other and it's, it's really interesting to watch for me. Um, that, that's always had a very great appeal to me. I generally tend to like love stories better in the beginning stage of uh, their relationship or whatever um, than later on. So I would definitely have to say the beginning. Second question. Would you rather read books only from one author for the rest of your life or only one book from many authors? And that's, that's an easy answer. Um, definitely one book from many authors because first of all you have way more choice. I mean, one author writes maybe, I don't know, 10 books? Maybe. Um, so you get to read 10 books of your life. Also, I don't usually decide on what book to read next based on who wrote it. So you generally don't don't um, make a habit out of going back to that one author. I just see what's around and kind of try out different things. So it would definitely be uh, one book by many authors because that's what I'm actually doing already. <laughs> Question number three. What book have you reread the most? Ah, oh, definitely Harry Potter. I had a phase when I was like, I think maybe five or six books were out at that point where I would just start at the beginning of the series, read all the way through, and then at the end notice that I forgot details from the first book already and just start at the beginning again. Um, I think I read the third book the most and a was probably 13 times. I'm not even kidding. Yeah, 13 times. I was crazy obsessed with Harry Potter. Crazy obsessed. Um, now, which fourth question, would you rather be in a faction or a district? And I think this applies to like a faction from um, the Virgin and the district from Hunger Games. And obviously faction, I mean, Factions are awesome and districts are kind of suppressed and most of them are so poor So then I have to say faction and it will be dauntless Absolutely dauntless and nothing else. Oh um, Dauntless is just awesome. I love dauntless. I want to jump from train cars and stuff like that It's just cool Um, If you could live in any book, what would but if you could live in any book, what world would it be? Hmm let me take a sip of my green tea and ponder that question. Ah, hot. Am I totally unoriginal when I say... Divergent? I really want to be in a faction. Really bad. I really, really want to be in Dauntless. Ah. Would you rather be invisible or be able to fly and why? Be invisible? Um, the problem with being able to fly is, would you, like, how would that work? Would you have wings? That would be very inconvenient. And if not, would you make swimming motions? That would look stupid. So, being invisible ha definitely has its perks. And I would want to be invisible and eavesdrop on everybody's conversations. Because I'm a stalker like that. <laughs> if you had a day, wait. If you had to date, no. If you had to date a paranormal person, what type would you date? Fairy, vampire, werewolf, fallen angel, demon, shadow hunter, witch, or mermaid slash merman? Huh. When I say witch, do they include wizard? Because I would want to date a wizard and want him to teach me how to be a witch. If that's something you can teach, because I want to be a witch so bad. Or fallen angel. Oh, I had a, had a time. Like, there was a time when I was obsessed with Fallen Angels books, like, I read them all, like, Hush Hush and Crescendo and Fallen and the other, the sequel and other stuff as well. I love Fallen Angels. Yeah, they're 
cool. And then last question is sort of optional, a uh, fun question it says. As a job, would you rather fill in for Santa or the Easter Bunny? Since we don't have Santa Claus in Austria, I would say the Easter Bunny. And Easter is cool, it's warmer, you don't have, you don't have a big fat belly and I don't really care for a grey white beard either, so I would want to be the Easter Bunny. So yeah, that's it for this quick fun tag video starring green tea um i love doing tags i'm gonna do a lot more in the future because i won't yep, they're awesome i'm gonna talk to you guys soon bye